Hi. How are you? I'm well. How are you? Great. Okay, let's talk about Shia. Let's. <laughs> what did you think when you had to play the whole switching Mary's pills for uh, sugar or? Uh, I think it was a probiotic. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, I didn't know it was coming, and so reading the script one night, you know, as soon as we get it, we would like scramble and open our emails, and no matter what you were doing, you'd stop everything. And I remember I had to like go back and be like, I must have read that wrong. <laughs> like, I don't, she can't have possibly. Let me go back. So I went back and I read it again, and I was like, Oh my god! <laughs> like, how am I gonna? And Ashley Scott is just the nicest person. Like she's not the person that you want to switch pills on. But um, you have to go to a different place. It's not me. And when and when it aired, what kind of feedback were you getting from fans? Did you hide out from Twitter? Or not what? at all. I actually absolutely love it because when you do something that's that sort of huge and and polarizing, if people don't have a response to it, then to me it would be like I didn't do a great job or people weren't invested in the story. So for the sort of like huge reaction that it's had. I mean, like, people are like, I hope you die. <laughs> I, I love it, though, because they're so invested. And to me, it's like a pat on the back. So are you in the finale at all? I am. Okay. You'll see me tonight. What can you tease? Nothing. <laughs> well, just talk about being part of this show and how, um, you know, there was some controversy. You know, Chris Harrison's, you know, just came out this week. And, right. But it really, the show really seemed to spark some, spark love, spark passion, spark Buzz. Yeah, what I, what I think is so great is despite the sort of construct of this world within a world, um, all the issues that people are dealing with are issues that we deal with all the time. Ambition, morality, what will you or won't you do to get, you know, what is your dream, whether that's marrying a handsome, you know, suitor or becoming an executive producer on your own show. Like, what will you and won't you do for what you want at the end of the day? So I thought that was a big part of the reason that people identified so strongly with the show. And can you talk about the social media aspect of Unreal because yeah. everybody was live tweeting every and periscoping and yeah it's really cool so I actually joined uh, Instagram and Twitter for the show like I had no experience with it before so I'm still very much a novice and it's so crazy to think like perfect example I was um, a thing I love to do I love to go to like a Barnes and Noble and sit and read and have a coffee in the co in the like cafe if I have a few hours off and I was there on Sunday and the next day I got a tweet that was like, Aline, is this you? You were, and I was like a photo of, and I was like, wait, what? <laughs> it's just, it's kind of mind blowing how small the world gets with social media, which is really great. Great, thank you. You're welcome.